So, how is the news going to spin what happened with the train train gun? Uh, yeah. Excuse me. Uh, I can't talk today. I was trying to say, how is the news going to spin the story about our little train robbery? Let's find out. Ladies and gentlemen, each night I bring you the news in the most fair and balanced manner possible. But tonight I have a commentary. Some have asked me what huh. the difference is between our leader, Emperor Mansk, and the traitor, Jim Rayner. They point out that Mansk oh, rebelled really? against the government of his youth and came to power through the use of violence and subversion. Why is it wrong for Jim Rayner to rebel in similar fashion? There is a difference. When Emperor Mansk began his revolution, there was no threat hanging over humanity. James Rayner is waging his revolution while we are at war with two alien races. James Rayner, you don't have you to no be uh, at war against the Protoss. You fall in line, putting your petty complaints aside as we struggle for humanity's very survival against this alien menace. Everyone's a critic. <laughs> yep, ain't that right, Jim? Of course, he conveniently doesn't know the little facts about, oh, I don't know, that uh, Manx uh, committed an atrocity on Tarsonis by using the Psy emitter to have the Zerg kill, like, billions of people on that planet. Not to mention that he also abandoned Kerrigan there, which led to her becoming the Queen of Blades, which, of course, uh, was a backstabbing for Jim as well, because she was the woman he loved, and he demanded that they send backup or extract her from the planet, you know, get her out of there. And Manx said, yeah, guess what, I'm not going to do that. And that was it for Jim, that's when he left. So, if you don't remember that, just go back and watch my playthrough of the original StarCraft, and uh, you'll see what I'm talking about. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> that's that's uh, quite a reason why Jim is uh, doing this revolt against Manx. But anyway, uh, Tosh. Robin Trains. We'll make a pirate out of you yet, Mr. Rena. <laughs> huh. Uh, well, that's something that I think he and Tychus should do. In fact, let's talk to Tychus. Robbing a train again get you feeling nostalgic? Damn straight. We must have hit the Shale Express a dozen times back in the day. See? I told you. <laughs> a couple ah, old cowboys reminiscing about the good old days. Me. Almost got us killed when they smartened up and started using Outriders to chase us. Never was a man of them could keep up with you on a vulture, Jimmy. Just add it to the fun. How the hell you <laughs> I remember that vulture. Marshall after all that? <laughs> I'll never know. <laughs> that is kind of a good question, how he ended up becoming a marshal after all that. Alright, let's go to the lab. Hello, Dr. Hansen. Jim, let me in. What really happened on Tarsonis? Uh, Whatever are you going to tell her, Jim? I can see it tearing you up inside. Tarsonis. That's where it all went yep, down. Yep, that's where it all happened. Menk stole a psi emitter from the Confederacy and planted it there. He knew that it had tracked the Zerg, and our revolution began that day. The day Mensk murdered a whole planet and called it justice. Yeah, My God. some justice. Billions of innocent people. That's... that's just... monstrous. No wonder you hate him so much. Well, it wasn't just that, it was the conversation that they had afterward where he told him he didn't care and he would rule the sector and he and he would just uh either they would fall in line or he would burn everyone and everything in the sector to the ground if they didn't uh obey him that's when you knew okay this guy is a power hungry tyrant so oh it's a stash down here user identified <laughs> rainer james still playing hard to get all right uh What's my progress now after getting that research? Oh, one more point. One more point. And then I can get either the Hercules, a massive transport ship, or the Predator, anti-infantry specialist, has a powerful area attack. Interesting. Stepman? We need more samples. I'll get you those samples. All right, to the armory. Swanee! Yeah, yeah, good old days, robbing trains, yada, 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 <laughs> yeah. I'm making diamond backs. <laughs> He's like, yeah, 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 yeah. Old days, blah, 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 yada, yada, yada. I'm, I get to make diamond backs. That's the awesome thing, man. Come on. <laughs> All right. Speaking of which, let's take a look at the armory console. 
Ooh, we can upgrade SCVs now. Ooh, hello. Uh, SCVs can repair twice as fast. That's pretty good. Multiple SCVs can build a structure. Each additional SCV reduces build time. Building cost remains the same. That's pretty good. Look at this. You can have multiple uh, SCVs make a command center, and that would cut the time that's built dramatically. That's awesome. Vehicles. Diamondbacks. They get next plus one range. They get plus 50 life. Hmm. I'm wanting to fo focus on uh, the upgrades for certain base structures, but also for certain units that are also uh, the mercs. So like, for example, the fire bats, let's give them the extra armor. There we go. 45,000. Uh, the range of all units in the bunker by one. Hmm. Yeah, I'm going to save for the 45,000 for something else. So, all right, to the bridge. Matt. I've been looking for an encryption expert so we can access the adjutant we recovered. No luck so far. Uh, Colonel great. Orlin at Dead Man's Port can crack anything. Haven't been back there in a while. Say, didn't you end up <laughs> getting married last really? time we were there? I told you before. If I knew what the prize was, I never would have joined that card game. <laughs> There's just something about a lover's reunion that chokes me up. <sighs> that is great! So apparently Matt was in a poker game at that uh, what I'm guessing is like a pirate or a smuggler's uh, you know hangout called Dead Man's Port. That just sounds like a place that uh, criminals would hang out at. He got into a poker game or I guess a card game, and the prize was some girl who and he ended up he won the game and he ended up getting married. Oh my gosh, that is hilarious, Matt Horner. You have got to tell me about that story, man. Come on. <laughs> Jim loved that. He was like, hey, something about a love is reunion. <laughs> that was great. All right, let's see. Oh, speaking of which, Dead Man's Port. Dead Man's Port is the main settlement on the planet Dead Man's Rock. Infamous for its lawlessness, the port is home to smugglers, pirates, and mercenary groups. It is remote enough to retain its independence despite antagonizing every major Terran power. We still need to access the adjutant we retrieved from Tarsonis. Our old mercenary associate, Colonel Orlin, is an expert in Confederate code decryption. If our intel's right, hmm. he should still be based at the Merc Haven at Dead Man's Port. He's not very trustworthy, but he's our best bet of breaking that encryption. Alright, so here we get the classic Vulture, which is uh, uh, a unit that uh, Jim used to run around with in, in the uh, original game. And of course we have Zill here. Mobius New Folsom, what's this? Oh, this is Patash. Fulsom is right for the taking, man. Every voice that was ever raised against Minsk is pinned up inside those walls. We let all them prisoners loose, and he'll never know what hit him. Just let me know when you're ready to pull the trigger. Hmm, now this is interesting. It's not unit acquired during selected mission, but it's not letting you know what it could be. It's a question mark. I wonder what that could possibly mean. So, there's no research, but you do get bonus opportunities to get even more credits. Hmm. Now that is interesting. I'm gonna hold the off on that. I'm gonna- I'm feeling I wanna do either this or this. Hmm. New Folsom is a notorious political prison where enemies of the Dominion are kept on ice. Its remote location and inhospitable landscape make escape virtually impossible. Hmm. I'm kind of feeling like I want to help out Tosh with this and then we'll do Zill. So let's see what's going on here, why this is a question mark. Where's Tosh? I thought he'd be here by now. He already left the ship. I thought you... Sir, we have an incoming transmission. It's highly encrypted. Patch it through. Hmm. Well, well. Oh. The well, hello there. Jim Rayner. My name is Nova. We should talk. Now, what would one of Menk's pet ghosts have to say to me? Ah. Tosh is lying to you. Get Tosh really? Outcomes. I'm sure he's listening in anyway, encrypted or not. Yeah, he probably is. We Spectres be the future. You just couldn't handle it, little girl. Every ghost that became a Spectre has gone on a psychotic killing spree. The ones I've captured are held in New Folsom. 
Don't listen to her, brother. Help me bust the specters from New Folsom. And we'll bring down Minx together. Tosh wants to reactivate his specter buddies, using the substances you helped him collect. New Folsom is full huh. of psychopathic killers. Do you really want to release them into the galaxy? I be helping you against Minsk, and my people will too. She won't even join you. He's a psychotic time bomb. He'll be on your side, right up until he puts a knife in your back. This be the moment of truth. Make your choice. Wow, so here is the first of when this game actually offers you choice in different missions. You get to choose. So, let's break this down. Help Tosh break into New Folsom Prison and free the Spectres held inside. Tosh will remain with you for the rest of the campaign, training Spectres for your use. You get the Spectre, which is an infiltration unit. They can use ultrasonic pulse and cloak abilities and can also call down tactical nukes. So that's pretty awesome. Help Nova destroy the Spectre training facility on Avernus Station, ending the threat of psychotic rampages by rogue Spectres. Nova will teach you how to train ghosts, but she won't join your cause. Uh, ghosts are si similar to uh, specters, except they can snipe. Well, here's the thing. Here's how I break this down. First off, New Folsom Prison is a political prison, which tells me that it's more likely they have people there that uh, Manx put in there just because they spoke out against him. So there are a lot of innocent people that are being held there uh, for no good reason. Also, how do we know that Nova isn't the one who's lying to us? For all we know... She could be telling us this under the orders of Mengsk. Like, Mengsk could possibly have found out about this, about my association with Tosh, and told her, Look, feed Rainer a lie about uh, rogue specters going on a killing spree, and get him to side with you and take out that threat Tosh for me. Uh, so he'll do my bidding for me. You know, and at this point, Tosh has not really been, like that ill will or psychotic or such towards Jim. I mean, Jim has been a little kind of, yeah, I'm going to keep my eye on you. I'm not sure if I completely trust you yet. But Tosh has never been like, well, forget you then, you know, or anything. He's like, okay, all right, that's fine. We'll see. You know, until you trust me, you know, we'll have little to discuss, things like that. So Tosh has been pretty nice and fair to us, you know, during this time. So I just met Nova. And considering that she's that she won't join us, that tells me she's still loyal to Manksk. And how can I trust her, knowing that she's loyal to Manx, while and also not knowing whether or not she's the one who's lying to us about whether or not Tosh is lying? She's she could, for all I know, she's the what she said about Tosh lying. That could be a lie. So I'm more likely to trust Tosh than her. So I'm gonna help out Tosh. And I have a couple you other reasons, but you'll find out you later. Really planning Tosh, but I'll take your word over Dominion assassins any day. We've come this far together. May as well see it through. You've made a poor choice, Mr. Rayner. Yeah, we'll see about that, Nova. I knew I could count on you, brother. Now let's go and bust open Of course, brother. Yes, let's go bust them out, brother. Uploading new Folsom data now. Feast your eyes on this, brother. They're locked down tight. Nova. Woo, now that is a prison. We're gonna need an army to break into that place now. Even an army couldn't get you yep. in there. But one man, one specter in the right place, can find a way in. Hmm. Then our progress is all up to you, Tosh. I'll push my boys as hard as I can, but they're gonna need your help to gain ground. Sure, you sit back this time. I'll take the lead and clear the way. Just keep sending troops to keep the pressure on, and I'll do the rest. There are two cell nice. blocks containing military prisoners outside the main compound. If we break those uh -huh. open, we could probably count on help from the inmates. What else? Sweet! There's a Dominion base right by the main prison entrance. Take that out and the guards will retreat. The prisoners can handle it from there. All right, Tosh. You ready for this? I've been waiting a long time for this. I'm ready. So it looks like we may get to take control of Tosh in this mission. Be cautious around missile turrets and ravens. They can detect Tosh, enabling their allies to attack him. So yeah, it looks like I'm going to be controlling Tosh in this mission. And I'm going to have to uh, 
This is where we learned about detectors, uh, being able to uh, detect him even though he's cloaked all the time. So this is going to be a cool mission here. Check this out. See? He's permanently cloaked like a Dark Templar. Oh, he's already got a bit of a boost to damage. Keyboard shortcuts. Yes, I'm aware of keyboard shortcuts. So, yeah, Tosh, we have control over him. With my cloaking abilities, I can take out all these guards. They'll never see me. Let's just see about that. <laughs> Look at this, he's one-hitting him. Pow! I do what I want. I Ooh. can use a Saiyan. Mind Blast, a psionic explosion at a target location, damaging and stunning enemies within a larger effect. Great for helping take out groups of Dominion Marines. Missile turrets and ravens can detect cloaked units and make them susceptible to attack. Destroy the detectors to remain cloaked and unseen. An right. explosion to take out groups of Marines. A little trick I call Mind Blast. Oh, look at this. Jim's got Rainer's Raiders. Huh. He's got his own base set up over here. Nice. Okay, so he's going to be collecting resources and just sending these units to help uh, back me up. And I'm just going to basically try and help them advance on the base. Very nice. That turret across the bridge. It can see me and alert its allies if I get too close. Even with my stealth. Ah. This. Ah. There we go. Took it. Took it out. Took out the turret. Oh. Ah. Ah. Oh boy. This is bad. Whew. That was close. Hang in there, Tosh. My boys are moving in to back you up. Remember. Just keep Here they come. In troops, and I'll do the rest. All right, so I can use Let's the medics that he's sending to that. heal myself. I do. Heal me, I medic. Do. Good job. Now go help out those marines. Maybe yes, maybe no. So I can use these guys to kind of be like cannon fodder. Up here, I can snipe them from a distance. There we go, check out that siege tank. Very nice. Jim, send, send some more guys to help me wipe out this area. Bleed up slow. Damn street. Extinguish the There we go. They got this factory here. Boom! There we go. Good work, Tosh. We're pushing on toward the front line. Nice! You'll set up a little base every time we progress. Oh, look at this. I can go through this little tunnel here. A little alleyway, I guess. When I need energy, I can use consumption to get more. I just steal a little life. Really? Lie. The more life they have, the more energy. It don't hurt. 
blood screamed. Huh. the first military cell block now. Releasing the prisoners might buy us some allies. Wipe out these guys right here. Oh, okay. I see. Let's do this. Get back here. There we go. I do what I want to. Alright, let's uh see if we can do about helping break these guys out of this prison. Oh, and they could use those diamondbacks. Nice. Damn street. Maybe yes. Let's just see. Damn street. Our allies are being attacked. There we go. Well, now I can just wipe out this turret because there's no other units to attack me. There we go. Yes, nice he's free. Work, Freeing those prisoners will really help us out. I got an extra amount of credits for that. Nice. Look at that. They're going to get in those diamondbacks and help us out. That's sweet. Our allies are being attacked. Maybe yes. You know what? I'm gonna make a save here because I have sometimes made a mistake and actually occasionally died. Oh, look at that, the Mexico! Nice. Look at that, the diamond back is here. that out. There we go. Very good. Alright, we'll give some more guys. Oh, look at that, he has those them setting up uh, bunkers and net and uh, barracks. You're close to the second military cell oh, block. Tosh. Here. Feel like making some new friends? Don't you worry about us, Tosh. We'll keep them busy while you free the prisoners. Yeah. Let's just see. There we go. Just in case Our I make a mistake here. Are being attacked. Let us go. Extinguish the fire. Oh, siege tanks. Act. Well, what a wall. Bad order. Our allies are being attacked. There we go. Now those boys yes, my friends, go get those siege tanks. Great job, Tosh. Maybe though. Medic, get over here and heal me. Tosh, we got a nuke ready for launch. Paint a target. Just don't call the strike in too close. Ooh, a nuke! I can launch five nukes. Tosh can call down a tactical nuclear strike at a target location. The nuke will land very quickly and obliterate everything in the area effect, including friendly units. Oh boy, that's not good. <laughs> the medics are healing each other. That's hilarious. Look, we can't do anything else. We may as well just heal each other. I can't believe he 
actually went out there. That Tosh actually went over there. I got hurt. I didn't even tell him to do that. Kill me to full full health, Merc or Medic. tanks. I think we just found our first area to drop a nuke. Right there! Our Boom! Ho 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 ho! Woo! Boy! the nuke right there on the turret Ow! you gotta be careful because if you're too close it will kill Tosh I do what I want to do bad mojo on the way our allies are being attacked here we go, drop another nuke right here. And I'll drop another one right over there. Our allies are being attacked. Let's do this. Here it comes! Our allies are being attacked. Boom! Attack. There goes the command center. Alright, now Jim is sending much more units my way. Very nice. I don't think I even need to use my last nuke. Because Jim's got his forces in abundance over here now. They got that side. I'm going to help out over here on this side. Wipe out this last bunker right over here. Look at this. Woo! Now this was a prison break. Yeehaw! You just unleashed a nightmare on all of us, Rainer. Heaven help you now. Maybe for Manx and his dominion. Wolves come tumbling down. Be free, my brothers and sisters. Your new life awaits. <laughs> I have a feeling there's some more truth to this than what Nova is letting on. She's painting them as pretty bad, but I have a feeling it may not be as bad as Nova is letting letting it on to be. Perhaps we shall find out. And since Tosh would be leading them and training them, I think they'll be pretty pretty good. Fifty years, and no one's ever escaped from New hmm. Folsom. But we broke it open in an afternoon. I can hardly believe we pulled it off. Hello, Tosh. Ooh, nice uh, tool. Yes, did good. Now me and my specters have finished the job. We have killed Minx. And burn his dominion to the ground. Overthrowing Mengsk is just the start. This is about building a better tomorrow. Huh. Don't you see? 
We just released every scientist, philosopher, and free thinker that ever challenged Manx rule. That was our real victory. See, I told you. You oh. really need that naive. Tomorrow there'll be a new Minsk. And another one after that. Your great hmm. shining dream of the future is just an illusion. Tosh may have a point. So if it's all so bleak, why are you here, Tosh? What do you get out of all this? Same thing as you, brother. I don't quit till Minsk is dead. Hmm. Vengeance doesn't factor into this. Our revolution's about freedom. Maybe not for you, Matt, but for for Jim, there is You'll some vengeance see that in this. Better future, Matt. But it ain't for the likes of us. Huh. Because there's himself part of the older generation that won't get to see that bear tomorrow, but Matt, as part of the younger generation, will get to see it. Hmm. Huh. Catch you later, Tosh. But see, I told you, since it said it was a political prison, that uh, Manx would have put people in there that were innocent and all they did was uh, challenge his rule as emperor. Matt pointed that out for me. Okay. So before we, uh... Oh, look at this up here. Huh, New Folsom Prison. James, I thought you might want to remember how we broke New Folsom Prison and Manx's dominion. I'm with you all the way, brother. Gabriel Tosh. Do not pick up hitchhikers. <laughs> All right, so quickly before we end this video, let's chat with Tosh. I took a big chance with you and your specters, Tosh. I hope Nova wasn't right about you. <laughs> Don't go believing that little girl's lies. The specter procedure affects everyone differently. But we're all still human. It's our choice whether to become specters. Not hers, not yours, and not Minsk's. Choice be the only huh. true freedom anyone gets. He doesn't want but anyone to be forced him? to do it. He don't want them to choose you? it. Don't you worry, none. We'll fight for you right to the end. All my brothers and sisters, we owe you everything. So he's basically saying that you have uh, not only earned my trust, but uh, you... But uh, you can definitely trust me, cause we owe you everything. So we we uh, you know we're obligated to fight for you. So anyway, we will uh, be not only going around exploring the Hyperion, but uh, see what other people have to say regarding this. In fact, we may find out a couple other interesting little tidbits and facts about that mission and uh, the whole thing about the Spectres. Stay tuned.